<laughs> okay. This time, we're going to be graphing equations that are in y equals mx plus b form, but we're going to be doing it using our knowledge of the y-intercept and slope. You need a, a place to start and then a direction to go. The y-intercept's the place to start, the slope's the direction to go. y equals mx plus b, so we have y equals one-third x plus three. Madison, what's our m? One over third. One <laughs> over three, yep. And how about Ava, what's our b in this problem? B is 3. Ava, since our B is 3, where is our graph going across the Y, the y axis? 3. <laughs> right, but tell me as a point. 0, 3. Yeah, 0, 3. Perfect. And then 1 over 3, that's rise over run, and we just have to make sure that we're rising 1 and running 3. So we go, we're going to plot this point first, the 0, 3, 1, 2, 3. Right there. We got that from the original equation. B is where the graph crosses the y-intercept. The graph crosses the y-intercept. Sorry, the y-axis at 3. And now we have to rise 1 and run 3. So rising 1, we go da 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 Rise 1, and we have to run 3. Up 1, over 3. I just put those little dots so you can see the trip. So that's the trip that this slope is telling us to take, and then we connect our dots. Connect our dots. Uh, no questions, but maybe, yeah. Yeah, we can ask questions. Uh, and then, oh yeah, label the points. Label the points. This first point is 0, 3. We already found that out. But now what's the second point going to be? Does anybody know? Connor. 4, 3. The first number is going to be 3 because it's over 3. Oh, four, 3, and then 4. Up 4. Yeah. Up 4. So we get the 2.03 and then 3, 4. That's how you graph using slope intercept form.